Tesla's $15,000 Model 2 spotted at Giga Texas crash testing. The first proof Elon's mass market EV is real. Why the secrecy until now? This isn't just another Tesla. It's a complete production revolution that could make EVS accessible to millions. What breakthrough made this impossible price possible? Let's dive right in. The covered Model 2 prototype spotted at Giga Texas isn't just another test vehicle. It's proof of Tesla's most closely guarded manufacturing breakthrough. For months, Elon Musk deflected questions about affordable Tesla pricing while quietly developing technology that makes $15,990 EVs profitable without subsidies. Here's what few people realize about Tesla's secrecy. The company has been testing a revolutionary 50,000-ton gigapress since early 2024, but kept it hidden from competitors and investors. This manufacturing monster, eight times more powerful than Model Y's 6,000-ton press, represents the largest automotive casting machine ever built. Why would Tesla accept this risk? Traditional automotive wisdom says you can't profitably build quality EVs under $25,000. Tesla's solution completely reimagines car construction. Instead of welding together 200-plus separate frame components like the Model Y, the Model 2's entire underbody emerges as a single aluminum casting. Think of it like the difference between assembling a complex puzzle versus stamping a coin. But there's a detail most people overlook. Tesla can cast five Model 2 underbodies simultaneously in one press cycle. This isn't just efficiency. It's a fundamental shift in automotive economics. Each casting cycle that previously produced one Model Y frame now produces five Model 2 frames in the same time. The engineering challenges were immense. Aluminum casting at this scale requires precise temperature control within 10 degrees Fahrenheit. Too hot and the metal warps. Too cool and it doesn't fill the mold completely. Tesla spent 18 months perfecting the process, testing hundreds of prototypes before achieving consistent results. And here's what's truly noteworthy about the timing. Tesla began crash testing the Model 2 in Q4 2024, suggesting production decisions were made months earlier. The vehicle measures 164 inches in length, 20% smaller than the Model 3, but the real breakthrough lies in its construction methodology. Tesla eliminated over 1,200 welds per vehicle compared to traditional assembly. Fewer welds mean faster production, higher structural rigidity, and dramatically reduced labor costs. The Model 2's body requires just 3.2 hours of assembly time versus 8.7 hours for a comparable traditional vehicle. We'll come back to this production advantage. But first, let's examine the battery breakthrough that makes $15,990 pricing sustainable. Tesla partnered with CATL to develop Chilin LFP batteries specifically for the Model 2. These aren't standard lithium iron phosphate cells. They're engineered to charge from 10% to 80% in just 10 minutes matching premium vehicle performance at fraction of the cost. The 53.5 kilowatt hour battery pack delivers an estimated 272 mile range, comparable to the Model 3 standard range, despite the smaller capacity. This efficiency comes from the Model 2's reduced weight, improved aerodynamics, and 16 inch wheels optimized for energy conservation rather than performance. But this is just the beginning. What's really surprising is how Tesla solved the cost equation that has stumped every major automaker. Tesla's pricing strategy becomes revolutionary when you understand what competitors are struggling with. Legacy automakers like Ford and GM are trapped by their own success. Decades of supplier relationships, union contracts, and manufacturing infrastructure designed for internal combustion engines. 
The Model 2's cost advantage stems from three breakthrough innovations Tesla kept secret until crash testing began. First, Tesla developed permanent magnet-free motors that eliminate rare earth material dependencies. Traditional EV motors require neodymium and dysprosium, costing $3,000 plus per drivetrain. Tesla's new design uses ferrite magnets and advanced software control, reducing motor costs to approximately $1,000 while maintaining comparable performance. Second, the structural battery integration makes the 53.5 kilowatt hour pack a load-bearing component of the chassis. This isn't just clever engineering, it reduces vehicle weight by 200 plus pounds while increasing torsional rigidity by 15%. Tesla essentially eliminated redundant structural elements by making the battery do double duty. And here's what few people realize about Tesla's timing. The Model 2 launches precisely as the $7,500 federal EV tax credit phases out for most vehicles. While competitors depend on government subsidies to reach competitive pricing, Tesla designed the Model 2 to be profitable at $15,990 without any incentives. Third, Tesla implemented 48-volt electrical architecture throughout the Model 2, a technology proven in the Cybertruck but never applied to mass-market vehicles. This system uses thinner wires, reduces copper requirements by 60%, and enables advanced features like steer-by-wire technology. The steering wheel connects electronically rather than mechanically to the wheels, eliminating complex mechanical linkages while enabling future autonomous capabilities. But there's something most analysts missed in Tesla's Q2 earnings call. Musk confirmed that more affordable models would begin production in the fourth quarter of 2025 but he didn't mention that Tesla had already solved the profitability challenge. Internal documents suggest Tesla maintains 18 to 22% gross margins on the Model 2, even at $15,990 pricing, comparable to luxury vehicles selling for three times more. The competitive landscape reveals why legacy automakers can't respond quickly. Ford's upcoming compact EV requires $4.2 billion in retooling costs and won't arrive until 2027. GM's Equinox EV starts at $27,495 after rebates, 72% more expensive than the Model 2. Stellantis has no comparable vehicle in development. Why would Tesla accept such aggressive pricing? The answer lies in Elon Musk's master plan to achieve 42 million Model 2 units over the vehicle's lifetime. More production than the Toyota Corolla and Volkswagen Golf combined. At this scale, even modest per-unit profits generate massive revenue streams while establishing Tesla as the undisputed mass-market EV leader. This leads to a remarkable discovery about Tesla's global strategy. The Model 2 will be produced simultaneously at Giga Texas, Giga Berlin, and the upcoming Giga Mexico facility. This isn't just about meeting demand, it's about regional pricing strategies that undercut local competitors worldwide. And here's why this changes everything for the automotive industry. The Model 2 represents Tesla's most audacious bet since the original Roadster that electric vehicles can achieve true mass market dominance, not just luxury market success. If Tesla executes this vision, the entire automotive industry faces an existential crisis within five years. Consider the mathematics of Tesla's ambition. Current global EV production approaches 14 million units annually. Tesla's Model 2, with simplified manufacturing and multiple production facilities, could potentially capture 15 to 20% of this market by 2028. At 2 plus million annual Model 2 sales, Tesla would sell more electric vehicles than most automakers sell total vehicles. But success isn't guaranteed, and here's where things get interesting. Tesla faces three critical challenges 
that could derail mass market dominance. First, battery supply constraints threaten the entire timeline. CATL must scale Keelan battery production from prototype quantities to millions of units annually. Any disruption in this partnership forces Tesla to find alternative suppliers or delay deliveries. Quality control at volume represents Tesla's second major risk. The Model 3's production ramp-up in 2018 to 2019 revealed Tesla's manufacturing limitations. Panel gaps, paint defects, and assembly issues plagued early deliveries, damaging Tesla's reputation among mainstream buyers who expect Toyota-level reliability. And here's what's truly noteworthy about Tesla's third challenge, competitive response. Legacy automakers won't passively watch Tesla capture mass market share. Ford, Stellantis, and others are developing their own sub-$20,000 EVs, potentially with government support. If competitors achieve similar cost structures through different approaches, Tesla's first-mover advantage disappears. However, the broader implications extend far beyond Tesla's individual success. The Model 2 proves that advanced EV technology can reach price parity with internal combustion vehicles without sacrificing essential features. Autopilot capability, over-the-air updates, and supercharging compatibility remain standard, demonstrating that democratized technology doesn't require compromised functionality. Most importantly, Tesla's integrated manufacturing philosophy, once considered risky corporate strategy, now appears prescient. While competitors outsource components and depend on supplier networks, Tesla's vertical integration enables cost control and innovation speed that traditional automakers simply cannot match. The timeline for automotive transformation has compressed dramatically. Five years ago, industry experts predicted affordable EVs wouldn't arrive until 2030. Tesla's Model 2, targeting Q4 2025 deliveries, advances this timeline by half a decade. This acceleration forces every automaker to reconsider their electrification strategies immediately, not gradually. What happens if Tesla achieves its 42 million unit production goal? The automotive landscape fundamentally shifts toward electric propulsion. Internal combustion engines become economically obsolete for most consumer applications. Gas stations face an existential crisis. The entire petroleum automotive complex must adapt or face irrelevance. But perhaps the most significant impact lies in proving that technological advancement can truly democratize, rather than concentrate, benefits. The Model 2 maintains Tesla's signature innovations while achieving unprecedented affordability. This combination of advanced features and accessible pricing could accelerate global EV adoption by decades rather than years, fundamentally reshaping transportation worldwide. This is exactly why Elon Musk kept the Model 2's true capabilities secret until crash testing began because Tesla didn't just create another electric vehicle. They solved the fundamental economics of mass transportation. What this means is that we're witnessing the moment when EVs transition from premium products to essential infrastructure, accessible to the 200 plus million Americans who couldn't afford previous Tesla models. The Model 2's $15,990 price point without subsidies represents more than automotive innovation. It's proof that advanced technology can democratize rather than concentrate wealth. When millions of families can access autopilot, over-the-air updates, and supercharging networks at used car prices, we're looking at the fastest transportation transformation in human history. And this is just the beginning. Tesla's 42 million unit production target means we'll see Model 2 variants, autonomous taxi fleets, and manufacturing techniques that make today's assembly lines look primitive. By 2028, 
Every major automaker will either adopt Tesla's integrated approach or risk obsolescence. But here's what really matters. The ripple effects extend far beyond cars. Cheaper EVs accelerate renewable energy adoption, reduce urban pollution, and fundamentally reshape how cities plan transportation infrastructure. We're not just watching Tesla disrupt automobiles. We're seeing the foundation for sustainable mobility worldwide. How do you think legacy automakers like Ford and GM will respond to Tesla's $15,990 pricing? Can they adapt their century-old manufacturing systems fast enough? Or will they become the next Kodak? This is Tesla Revolution Analysis, where we decode the innovations reshaping transportation. If breakthrough automotive technology interests you, you know what to do. The age of affordable electric transportation has arrived, and it's happening faster than anyone predicted.